peaceful, isn't it? Hmm. I'm cooking, I'm cooking. Rice and miso soup, eggs and natto. And the main course, broiled fish. I'll give them a truly fine, proper Japanese meal. Now, hopefully, this food will cheer them up just a little. Ow! Hey, wait a minute! Come back here! Damn it, I'm not gonna let this main dish get away! Uh. <sighs> it's... it's okay, Celsia. You don't understand. That pigfish was your share, not what I had in mind. Take your hand off Regina at once! You let her go right now! God damn it! Guess we knew it all along. Huh? But it still can get to you. I suppose we'll always be unwelcome strangers from another world in this place. Hmm? Meow! Thank you, Peachy. Huh? Hello, you two! Almost time for breakfast! Damn it! Don't be such an airhead, Celsia! <laughs> oh, I'm really sorry, Miss Celsia. I just don't have much of an appetite. Oh, I envy all you pandas. Just stick some bamboo in their mouth and they're real happy. Oh, calm down, Celsia Marie Claire. Red light, green light, red light, keep your temper. A rectangle is a parallelogram, all of whose angles are right angles. Moron! Invertebrates have no backbone. Slug! One plus one equals a doofus. Smile? Ugh, I'm getting sick. Come on! Let's eat! After that, we'll go find the elf that lives in that mountain. Aw, oh, hell no. Huh? Another 1,013 spell fragments left. Uh, it, it's, it's all right. We'll find them soon. I have a feeling we'll find one this time. So what? So what? I'm not in the mood. Store's not open today. <sighs> all right, then. I'll go find the spell fragment myself, you lazy bonehead. Uh, Miss Celsius. Don't worry about me. <laughs> I can't believe it. Just look at his attitude. You try to be nice to him, and then what does he do? Oh! 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 End of the road? Then why is the crystal active? I wonder if there's a path someplace. Huh? There! It flashed again! This is what was reflecting the sunlight. <gasps> I never thought there would be an ancient city behind a waterfall. So why would an elf be in a place like this, huh? What on earth? I never thought I'd find an ancient city hunting after an elf. Oh, what's that? This is finally it! This is Rim City, home to what we've been looking for! Hey boss, won't we be cursed for doing this? Oh. Since when were treasure hunters ever worried about curses? Hey boss, uh, this door is pretty sturdy. Keep at it until we blow that sucker down! Yes, ma'am. Right. Let's go!
So, a ruin vandalizing elf. You just wait, Junpei. When I bring back a spell fragment, you'll be crawling. <laughs> Oh well, a panda. One, two, three. Jim Pei. Yeah. Think Miss Celsia will be okay on her own? She may be a second class panda, but she's a first class sorceress. I know that, One, but two, relax. Three. We're closed now for the day. Uh, huh? Hmm? What the hell? Treasure? What? This treasure doesn't weigh much. Let's see what's inside then. Open it up, Ritsko. Maybe smoke pours out and you turn into an old man. <gasps> now you tell me when it's too late, you goofball. Pillows, huh? One, two, six of them. Lousy excuse for treasure. Pillows? This billows. Uh, enough with the bad puns. They do look like ordinary pillows. Hey, this so feels cool. good. You're right. Look at my bed at home. Hey, don't sleep like that. You'll catch a cold or something. You can't already be asleep. Meow. Uh, even me, Kay? Why, even this curious cat is sleeping with a pillow. I can't believe even I'm beginning to feel a little sleepy. The pillow disappeared? What is this? Kotatsu foot warmer, bristle grass, and a bouncing ball. All the things that a cat would love. But where did all this come from? It's as if Mike's dream became real. <laughs> That's it! I finally found it! The legendary magic item! The dream pillow. <laughs> what? what? What is it? And uh, who has those dream pillows? They must have floated down the river. Damn! Oh, no! Huh? Who is it? <laughs> you, you, you're the... You're no ordinary panda, are you? Well, you're so right. Huh. So you're a panda acting like a hyena going after our leftovers. I'm not interested in what you leave behind. Not even the legendary magic item? The famous dream pillow? Uh... The d dream pillow? Oh, then you must have heard tell of it. The pillow that can materialize anything that you can dream. This must be Rem, the magical city of sleep. Then this ruin is Rem? <laughs> Please tell your friends you were defeated by the lethal Mistress Bazaar. Bazaar? The infamous treasure hunter. Now I can see that you plan on stealing the dream pillow and selling it. <laughs> Why would I sell it? Huh? Treasure hunting is not the most reliable of jobs to have. I figured I'd wash my hands of this racket and start something big. Something big? Dominate the world. What's that? Just think about it, Panda. Why not use the Dream Pillow to materialize the most powerful weapon in the world? However, now with the Dream Pillow gone, this is all an empty dream. I have to say, that's why I'm suddenly in a really, really bad mood. <laughs> that's how I feel. That's what I was just about to say. Giant chicken! I will beat you to a pulp with my bare fist, you foul brained beast! How are you? Oh. A lovely day, isn't it? 
isn't it? A polite chicken in a turban and curry! Eggplant curry and curry beef, cheese curry and shrimp curry. And the smell, it's real, thank you! You're welcome. I see. So you're a good guy, right? Huh? But I've got no chicken curry here. Oh, hey, come on. Oh, well then, down the hatch! <sighs> wow! What a delicious looking tank! Oh, oh Miss Celia! Play somewhere else! God damn it! And I was about to grab some chow, too. What a strange dream. Huh? You were having a strange dream, too? Oh, so did you. You bet your life. I would have been chowing down if I had just a couple of more minutes. Damn it! Ugh. Probably on a banquet of curry, is that right? Huh? Oh, you're so predictable. So what kind of dream did you have, Ritsko? <laughs> uh... Lobster tank. Ha 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 ha! Lobster tank! You tease me about curry? <laughs> oh, I guess Junpei and I are a lot more alike than I'd like to think. Oh, I'm starving. Yeah, me too. Hey, Celsia! How is our food coming anyway? Oh, where the hell is she? I guess she's not back yet. Will you look at this? Rice and miso soup, natto and some fried eggs. Nah, this is weird stuff that just looks like it. Geez, this breakfast is indigestion waiting to happen. Poor Miss Celsia. Huh? She must have been up all morning preparing this wonderful meal just to try to cheer both of us up. She must be pretty worried about you and me. Ah, oh, man, this is just totally wrong. Huh? You and me. You're so right. We're just sulking like a pair of little spoiled babies. And I'm sure all this is tough on Miss Celsia as well. Exactly. She's the only person here who can understand what we have been going through. Miss Harry. That's right. I can feel Miss Celsia's emotions through this cooking. Awful. Ugh. Where are you going, Junpei? It's her fault we have to eat horrible cooking like this. Ugh. So I'm gonna go nab her and make her suffer along with us. Yeah, let's give her a big welcome. I said nothing about welcoming her! I said I'm going to go nab her, damn it! Huh? What's that? Sounded like that came from the mountain. So, had enough? Damn it! This wasn't supposed to happen! <laughs> you're going to get really burned if you think I'm an ordinary panda. You have any idea who you're dealing with? The elder of all common elves of the Camargan region, Celsia Mary Claire! <laughs> you were idiots to believe you were ever a match for me. We're, we're so terribly sorry! Please forgive our many transgressions. We didn't know you were one of those mega evil villains. Those who <laughs> hunt elves! Who you calling a villain? No! Oh, just spare our lives! Ah! Hmm. I don't sense the energy of the restoration spell radiating from you, so you must not have a spell fragment. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Celsia! Celsia! Hey, are you alright? Huh? This looks just like the place I saw in my dream. Dream? Uh, yes. Miss Celsia was right there Rinchan! and... Rinchan! Over there was... Huh? Yeah, What's that? <laughs> what's a shrimp doing here? That's not a shrimp, it's a lobster! I don't think that's the problem! Hey, that's it! That's the big lobster tank I saw in my dream! In your dream? Lobster! Ah, this this isn't, isn't a dream! dream. Problem here, is it? That's strange. As soon as my pillow.
pillow disappeared, my dream became real. A pillow? Dream oh. pillow? Pillow disappearing? But my pillow's right here. Huh? Oh. Oh. What could be next? Hey, that's the chicken that appeared in the dream that I had. In your dream? Then you people use my dream pillows. Not my no. I knew it. Your dreams really do come to life with these dream pillows, don't they, Junpei? Wait, then that means... Ah! Hey, Junpei, are you coming to help me? Are you all right, Chicken Dude? Ah! Ugh, that hurt. Huh? Ah! Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Exactly like how it happened in my dream. Then what happens after this in your dream? Oh, well, it's so really gross. I really don't want to talk about it. She gets all stretched out by the lobster. What? Oh, no, no, please! Oh, no! Make hay! It's gone! Huh? Hooray for fantasy! Let's have some curry now! Gah, you must have amnesia from the knock on the head! Think back! You're a chicken, an honorable chicken that makes great curry! Gah! Snap out of it! Come on, come on! Get a hold of yourself! Remember now? Yes. Yes! Namaste! Oh, yeah! You remember uh, now! Thank you! You can just start making that curry as fast as you can! You got it! He's gonna attack Junpei! Well done. <laughs> that was close, Junpei. Well, don't you thank me, Junpei. What? what are you doing? Hey, let me go! Hey, is that how you treat a person who just saved your life? This is why I hate fantasy stories! Oh. Uh, where am I? Oh, ouch, what a trip. I guess we were carried downstream. Hey, hey, boss, take a look! Huh? Dream pillow! There was still one left. I can take over the world now. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, if only I'd known what that pillow could do. What kind of a dream did you see, Peachy? It's a secret until the pillow disappears. I wonder if our little Peachy has any dreams at all. Well, don't, don't care. care. Oh, fine. If I'd already known about this, then I would have dreamt about going back to Japan. <laughs> Rechan, you should know that you rarely experience dreams exactly as you would envision them. I guess you're right. Ah! They're adorable! Oh, I love you so much, so much! Let me kiss you. In any case, you. she could never pull it off now. Ah! Hey, the world is safe. So what kind of a dream did you have, Miss Airy? I'm sure you'd like to know. My pillow vanished a short while ago, so we should find out soon enough. Oh, give us a hint. <laughs> it's something we'll all appreciate. Is it an assault rifle? A bowl of curry? Junpei turned into a bug. Wrong answer. Yeah? The answer is I dreamt about collecting all the spell fragments. What? Uh huh? Are you serious, Miss Airy? Very. Oh, yes! We'll get back home to Japan. You really are something, Miss Airy. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, Mikay! Don't stop all of a sudden! Oh. What's the matter, Mikay? Well, it looks like we finally arrived. What? Mikay, lights! Oh, oh. What? What? oh man! The, world go the road is gone! Uh, what's a canyon doing here? Hey, look! Ah! 
Why, it, it's... We're back at Tree Town! As I thought, the spell fragments are here. Ah! 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 What the hell is going on? Ah! remaining 1,013 spell fragments? Will Junpei and the others get back to Japan? And what about me? Will I stop being a panda and go back to being Celsia Marie Claire, the elf elder? But this episode title worries me. Next on Those Who Hunt Elves 2, and Those Who Still Hunt Elves. Another bowl, please.